not gonna lie, it feels like fall. And to kind of get into this fall spirit, I'm gonna be showing you tons of outfits for you to wear this fall. So make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. And let's just get started. We're starting off with a very simple and basic outfit but i kind of still wanted to include this because not everything has to be super special and super extra so i'm simply just wearing a like a long sleeve top and i've paired it with these really nice mom jeans these are one of my favorite pairs of jeans i think that these are so nice and I've paired it with my Doc Martens, or I actually like Doc Martens dupes. And I've accessorized with this silver necklace with my initial on it. And then these are very, very tiny silver earrings because I just really want to stick to a simple look because I think that's what really suits this. And then for another variation of this outfit, I've styled this full leather laser over it which I think adds something really nice to this outfit, but it does kind of change up the entire like appearance of it in a way. I'm not sure if that makes sense, but it kind of gives off more of a body kind of vibe. I'm not sure. And the simplistic, minimalistic look is kind of gone, but I still really love to pair this jacket with it. This next outfit is probably my favorite outfit of the entire video. So this one is obviously more a bit like on the brownish side. I've got these really cute flared pants that I recently got at H&M. These are so flattering, honestly, which is the main reason why I love these. But also the pattern is, is super cute. And it's kind of like this brown houndstooth kind of pattern. And I'm still wearing the same black long sleeve from before. And it looks especially cute with the laser that I just showed you. But I kind of wanted to try and see how it looked with these insane platform boots. I also recently got these. As you can tell, the platform heel is literally insane like I can barely even walk with these I'm amazed that I'm still standing here but I feel like they go so well with the pants and it kind of adds a bit extra to the outfit in my opinion this outfit just screams fall and I just love it another way to wear these flower pants is to put on a really cute cable knit sweater on top of it so this one is a white sweater and I think that it goes so well with the pants I love the simplicity of this outfit and you can definitely dress down or dress up with it here. I kind of dressed up a little because I'm still wearing the platform boots and obviously that does seem very extra for an outfit but I feel like it just still goes so well with this and I love this little cable knit sweater because it's slightly cropped. If you want to give your outfit more of a soft look then switch out the flare pants for these pastel pink jeans because this obviously gives the outfit a completely different look and honestly i love both i think that these pink jeans are so cute because the pink is like not too bright but it's also not too pastel like i think it's just perfect and the sweater looks so cute with it especially because the sleeves are like slightly longer so it just feels super cozy and super comfy to wear especially if you can like accessorize with some cute jewelry or rings or just anything like that to feel super comfortable in this i personally really love this outfit and i thought that putting my hair up in a claw clip looks so much better with it because it kind of gives off the more soft vibe to it and like feeling more put together in a way and i decided to accessorize it with this super cute pink mini handbag that I've had lying around in my closet and I thought that it would be so perfect with the pink jeans because well it actually really does it's such a cute almost monochrome outfit but the wide adds a super nice contrast to it and honestly this handbag you guys is it's just too adorable not to wear and I just think that it goes so well with the rest of the outfit and I'm obsessed this is one of my favorites all right, we're going back to that brown beige kind of vibe. So here I'm actually wearing a skirt. This is a super cute mini pleated skirt, which has like a really nice pattern with beige and like brownish colors. And it completely changes up 
the tone of the outfit but i feel like it's so cute and honestly i've worn this exact outfit so many times during the last winter because it just goes so well together and i just feel like the sweater and the skirt go so well and to kind of add something very different to this outfit i thought i would wear my new racer jacket so I am not too sure if this suits the outfit, but we're just gonna ignore that for right now because I love this jacket and I wanted to include it in this video however I could. So I thought it would look kind of cute, but I am not too sure if it suits the skirt. All right, back to the pink jeans. I thought I'd give you a bit of a different look of how else you could style these. So here, instead of the white cable knit sweater, I'm actually I've put on this super cute crop top. It says you wish and it's just one of my favorite crop tops. I've gotten it recently and I've worn it so much and I think it suits the pink jeans super well because obviously like there's pink in both of them and I feel like this is such a Y2K kind of Pinterest girl aesthetic outfit. I don't know. I just feel like this is super trendy. If you're into that, then this is such a cute outfit. And I just think that these jeans are also super flattering. And I'm just wearing this really cute necklace with it. That is definitely my favorite necklace ever. I'm not sure if it suits the outfit, but here I am wearing it with these black flare pants, which as you can tell, it's such a different vibe, but it's still super nice. And I might like this a bit more. I'm not sure. They're both completely different outfits, but I love how it's like black on black. But then there's the contrast of the letters on like the top, which are like more of a hot pink color. And I just love that contrast. I feel like this is such a cute and trendy outfit. And I kind of wanted to accessorize it a little bit because I felt like it was missing something. So I put on this really cute hat that I've literally had for at least a year but i've never ever put it on so i was like okay this is the time for you to shine so here i'm wearing this really cute hat but i love this outfit i love how the hat just goes so well with the top and the flare pants but to kind of make it even more casual than it already was i put on this super super oversized hoodie from brandy melville that is my all-time favorite item because it is so cozy and so comfy to wear and so if you kind of want to be like super casual you just don't really want to put in too much effort with what you're wearing or just want to feel really comfortable in it then this is a really nice outfit for that you can skip the hat because i don't know if it suits it super well but i kind of want to do a bit of a variation from it so instead of the brown hoodie, I'm actually wearing my racer jacket here because in contrast to like the pleated skirt with the racer jacket, I feel like this actually looks good with it. I feel like the racer jacket suits this outfit a lot better. And yeah, we're just gonna get rid of the hat because that's not very suitable anymore with this racer jacket. But this outfit, chef's kiss. Something that absolutely cannot miss in your wardrobe is an Argyle sweater vest. So this is my favorite sweater vest ever and also my only sweater vest. But this has an Argyle pattern and it's got these blue tones and I am obsessed with it. It just screams fall to me and it is so, so perfect with a pair of flare pens. And I decided to accessorize it with this denim bucket hat that I have lying around because something in me was telling me that this would like suit the outfit so well. And honestly, I'm amazed by how good this looks. And it just suits like the colors of the top really nicely, which obviously is just such a nice contrast. And definitely if it's a bit colder, you can just style it with a super nice turtleneck top underneath the sweater vest, either white or black. I would probably say white because it kind of has like a contrast with the white on the sweater vest. So yeah, I think this is super cute. And the final outfit that I'm showing you guys is this really cute color coordinated one. So I don't know if it's color coordinated or just monochrome. I can never tell the difference between those two. But either way, this outfit is all brown, as you can tell. And the brown hoodie is making an appearance once again. 
obviously you cannot go wrong with this hoodie especially if you're literally wearing a brown set and then of course i had to throw in my brown leopard tote bag i feel like this outfit is super trendy maybe not so trendy right now it was definitely something that was huge like last year but i still like to wear something like this occasionally i just love the monochrome like vibe going on here and i love this set this set is super cute and actually super comfortable these pants are like kind of like flower pants and the top is actually super flattering so i just i really love this Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that you've kind of found some inspiration from these outfits. I really liked all of these fits and I think that all of these really suit like fall and like the fall vibe. Let me know in the comments down below which outfit was your favorite one and I will hopefully be seeing you in my next video. Please make sure to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Do it right now and I love you all so 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 much and until the next time. Bye.